everyone welcome back to my channel Lisa here and today I'm going to be sharing with you my little boys nursery tour so this has been highly requested what I will say is that the room is very very small I didn't actually plan on decorating this room for a little while but we actually decided last minute to kind of do it and I'm so so happy with how it turned out so we've gone for kind of like a Scandi boho kind of theme and I just think it looks really really cool so if you want to see what I've done with Orlando's nursery then just keep watching let's get started Okay, so on the door I've just got this little name sign. I actually bought this for when he was born so I could have it in the hospital, but I've just hung it on the door. And then I've also got this sign here which says baby's room. What I'll do is I'll link everything down below for you. Everything that I can link, I'll do that for you so you know where everything is from. So I'm gonna start with the floor. We've got this gorgeous rug which kind of goes with the Scandi theme that I've gone for in this room. It's kind of a Scandi kind of boho theme. And then you've got his cot, which is my favourite piece in the room. I just think it looks absolutely gorgeous. So it's like this ombre cot by the brand Snooze. You may already know that we've got a Snooze pod in our bedroom, which is absolutely amazing. So this is by the same brand. We've also got the Snooze surface mattress and also a Snooze sheet, which you can see there with, with the clouds on it. But yeah, I absolutely love this. It's so, so cool. I've never seen anything like it before with like the ombre. And I just thought it looked really, really cool. So I got that. And and then up here, another favourite piece of mine is his wire name, which you can see on the wall there. So Orlando Zeus there, which I just kind of themed this room around actually. It was something that I really wanted to have in this room. And I just think it looks gorgeous. And then if we keep going up, you've got his light there, which you may have already seen in a vlog before. This is from Ikea, and I just think it goes so, so well with the theme of the room. This here is from Laridou, and also we've got this little basket beside his bed. The basket I bought from Ikea, and I also bought the blanket from Ikea, and then the little elephant was kindly gifted to me from Mamas and Papas, and I just think it looks so, so cute. What I will say is everything in the cot right now will not be in there when he sleeps in here. It is simply for show at the moment. He doesn't sleep in here. He sleeps in our bedroom at the moment in the snooze pod, but this is just for show. So we've got this pillow here, which is from Matalan. This little rug, I'm not too sure where it's from, but you can buy similar ones from Ikea and Dunelm. And then the knitted chunky blanket you may have seen already as well. It's from a place called Blankets Beautiful on Instagram. And then I've got this cute little elephant. He is from the White Companies. This little owl is from Mamas and Papas. It's got music, isn't it? It's got like the sound of the womb, like the heartbeat. On the shutters, we've got some bunting, but it's quite hard to show you because of the, obviously it's light, but this is the bunting and it's got little pom-poms on there, which is sweet. And then if we come over to this side of the room, this is my favorite area. I just think it looks so, so cool. And this is like his chest of drawers, so I've got his clothes in here. And then we've got this gorgeous mirror. It's like a nice wicker mirror. I've never seen anything like it. I just think it looks so unique. And there's me. Hello. <laughs> We've got some nice little details on here. So we've got his first ever photo with his brothers, which I thought was really, really sweet. We've also got this little O block here with his initial on it. And then up here is a plant that I bought actually from HomeSense last year, but I just thought it would go really, really well in this bedroom, and it does. I've got this really cute baby records book with a little toy on the top of it. So this is just a little cute bunny, which is actually a gift. And I'm not too sure where the light is from. Absolutely love it. These chest of drawers are not to match the cot, but I think they go so, so well. And it's just enough storage for his clothes in there. I have also got a wardrobe in Renzo's bedroom still, which I hang things up in. But for now, this is where I just put all of his folded items. And then over here, we've got this plant, which I got from Ikea. And then it's just in a little bamboo kind of basket, which is from Laridou. Over in this corner, we've got my wardrobe, which is something that I couldn't get rid of. So this is why this room is quite small and quite difficult to kind of decorate. But I just thought I would show you this little corner so you know what it is. And it's just my wardrobe. But yeah, I absolutely love his bedroom. Let me know what you think of this kind of theme in the room and what your favourite item was. This is definitely my favourite item. And if you want to know how I've put this up, so basically Mark has put some little holes in the walls. And they just go into the wall. So he's just popped a few little holes. There's not too many. I think it's about four or five on like that one and then again four or five on that one there but it just like gives that kind of 3d effect which is super super cool i actually found this account on instagram it's called mummy lux and i just love it so much 
So that is the end of my nursery tour guys. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. What I'll do is I'll link everything down below, everything that I can link. And yeah, let me know what your favourite piece was in this room. I'll see you all in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And I'll see you all soon. Bye guys.